Back in the 90s, when I was traveling around, uh, I was uh, stopping by restaurants and bars and seeing what people were drinking. And we were making brandies and liqueurs. And there were a lot of people drinking a lot of wine and a lot of people that weren't drinking a lot of wine. And they were drinking a lot of vodka. And we're at a distillery. People are drinking a ton of vodka. Let's make vodka. That didn't go over too well. Dad didn't want to make vodka because it was just ethanol and there was no flavor and Dad's an artist of flavor. And at that, at that time we did not talk about flavored vodkas. The word was vodka and vodka to me yeah. means distilled clear it ethanol. Matter what kind of vodka, it was. vodka is vodka <laughs> for Dad. So I went back to the bars uh, and restaurants I was haunting and there's an orange flavored vodka, there's a lemon flavored vodka from big brands. And, and that was it. That was it. There was only two or three flavored vodkas back in the day. And I'm looking at the shelf at this bar and there's a lemon flavored vodka. I'm like, well, we have this extract from Meyer Lemons. It's going to be fantastic. We're going to use it for a liqueur, but Look at that, there's a lemon flavored vodka on the shelf. Let's make Meyer lemon flavored vodka instead of liqueur. And then I uh, talked to dad and said, hey, you know, I know you don't want to make clear vodka, straight vodka, but uh, you know, let's take this Meyer lemon extract that we're making and let's make flavored vodka. Let's make Meyer lemon flavored vodka. And then that way you can't say that there's no flavor in our vodka anymore. And um, uh, he, uh, dad agreed to it. and. All of a sudden, it went ballistic. This was made with a whole fresh, literally whole fresh lemon, or blood orange. We have no dyes, Nothing no preservatives, here, no additives. No in it. And, and so Things fall out of solution, but you just turn it, and then it goes back into solution. And so uh, all the color is it's coming it's from the all lemon. 100% all 100% from the real fruit. fruit. So that's, that's fruit. the fundamental difference. So again, we, we work with growers, and uh, we get the product shipped over when it's ready to roll shred it immediately and start the extraction process. So what happens in the extraction process is, uh, I like to say it's ASET technology. It's uh, ancient Serbian extraction techniques uh, that my dad taught me. Um, we use water, we use alcohol to pull and remove the colors and the flavors of the entire fruit. So you get the oils from the skins, you get the, the bitters from, the, zat, uh, from the, uh, the pith, the inside of the skin, the white part. And then you get all the juice and the acidity and the sweetness from, you know, from the whole fruit. And different citrus take different amounts of time to extract. The blood, or, uh, the Meyer lemons, for, it's about 68 days. A little less, a little more sometimes. And once we create, once we pull the color and flavor out of all that Meyer lemon, then we integrate that into our vodka and make fresh picked fruit flavored vodka. Sometimes we add sugar to balance the acidity, just to fine tune it. And that's a, that's a taste call. Uh, it's not, uh, uh, you know, I wish it was uh, set in stone where it's like, this is it, this is how many pounds we add, and that's it, and we keep it. But uh, it's not like that. Every season's different, so You're we- You're not stamping cookies. Yeah, we add, we add um, a splash to <laughs> balance the acidity, and then once we have that dialed in, uh, we filter it lightly just to remove all the chunks, you know, of, uh, of skins and uh, of the fruit particles to and trying to make it as clear as possible. But, uh, you know, things fall out of solution, but that's because it's real. Um, you know, we don't drop that out. You know, it's not a, it's not a 100% apps. Well, it is, it is soluble, but there's so much flavor that we pack into the vodka that through time, some things kind of fall out of solution in the bottle. But like I said, you just, like this, like that, goes back into solution. And it's just it's just proof that this is so ridiculously real. I mean, when you taste this, you taste the skins, you, you, you taste, taste the, the oils, lemon. like you're squeezing a twist, you taste the bitters from the pith, you taste the juice, the acidity, you taste everything from the entire whole fruit. Mm -hmm.